Well, thank you so much, Dominique. While there wasn't much snow, it was still a cold but rainy day for people in and around Charlottesville. Jacob Phillips takes us to the downtown mall to see how the chilly conditions are affecting people. The few that were actually out and about Saturday say it wasn't their first choice to be stuck in the rain, but they decided to still make the most of it. It's not fun to be out today. I'd rather be home in my PJs, uh, sipping on tea and watching Netflix, but I'm here and I'm going to enjoy. Instead of bundling up and binging her favorite show, Florence Sadler bundled up and toughed the wet conditions to go to work. I am volunteering at the Paramount and I wanted to keep my commitment. Sadler's from upstate New York, so cold weather doesn't bother her much. She does, however, worry about road conditions that follow. I was more concerned about ice than snow. And honestly, I've lived here for 32 years and my experience has been it's the drivers on the road that determine, not the weather. One couple came from Richmond to Charlottesville and said they experienced the roads firsthand. It being cold and driving on 64 in the in the rain, it's kind of a little a little worrisome. And Butterworth and Robert Ramsey were hoping for a weekend getaway and thought some better late than never flurries in the downtown mall would be a nice touch. We were planning on getting, coming here just for the snow, but it was like, oh, that's nice. That would be cute. Yeah. Instead, they got a cold, rainy day. So they spent it bouncing from shop to shop trying to stay warm. We're very motivated to go inside because it yeah. is so cold. <laughs> Looking for any, any store that will have us. Even though the rain might not be the most pleasant, it's still a nice little day. Yeah. In Charlottesville, Jacob Phillips, 29 News.